Bravo! 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 I went, I don't know. This is my first goddamn World Cup and it went off like this, man. This is my first goddamn World Cup and it went like this. One of the greatest of all time, as I'm told. Argentina and French. Oh! That hoe is stupid, man. Oh, Killian and them. Oh, Lionel and them. Buttonheads lived up to the goddamn hype, man. Oh, man. That was the greatest sporting event I've ever watched. It, it, it edges out. It edges out the 2016 Cavs versus Warriors 2016 finals for me. It edges it out. I'm talking about French started this game out. Dookie! They went into halftime with zero shots on target and zero shots, period! Argentina got them a Mickey Mouse pin to open that game up. I ain't gonna lie, it was Mickey Mouse, bro. Di Maria tripped over his own foot and fell, and they called a foul on goddamn Dembele. Dembele did get mixed up when he went behind Di Maria. Lionel ended up knocking that pin down. Oh, Lionel Messi, first score for that World Cup. All happy, bro. All like, yeah, Lionel. Get your goddamn World Cup trophy and solidify your status as the goddamn greatest of all time. And then, not too long after that, probably like 10 or 20 minutes after or something like that, Lionel got the ball, popped it up with his foot, oh, outside foot that hoe, right side, threw ball to the middle to Di Maria, ah, Di Maria, to make the score 2-0, oh, dos a cero. I say, oh man, it's looking bleak for France. I ain't gonna lie, no cap. France was such in a dire situation, they made two subs in the first half before the half ended. They got the ballet ass out of there, and they got Giroud, Giroud, Giroud. They got Giroud ass out of there, too. I was like, yeah, France panicking. Them boys look confident, too, like at the start of the game. Everybody was smiling, cheesy, you know, during the anthem. It was not, but come that halftime, them boys was panicking, bro. They was playing like they wasn't even in the final. They was playing like it was a regular game, and Argentina was on their ass like they was actually playing in the final. Mbappe was a guy. Damn ghost. That whole first half and the first half for the second half. Matter, matter of fact, the whole second half to the 80th minute, Kylian Mbappe was a ghost. Everybody was questioning him. Everybody in the Twitch chat was like, where is Mbappe? Where is Mbappe? I'm pretty sure everybody on Twitter, bro, where is Mbappe? Blah, 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 this, blah, 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 that. The whole second half is looking bleak. It's approaching the 80th minute. And I'm like, bro, it is 10 minutes left. This game is basically over. Kulamani has the ball inside the box. Bro gets kneed in the thigh fall. Pin. I say, uh oh. Uh oh. Y'all know pins change the flow of the game. It changed the tide of the game. Guess who finna take that hoe? Oh, Killing Mbappe. But I say, this is not a guarantee because they got a man over there named Emiliano Martinez. Argentina has a guy over there named Emiliano Martinez. And he's like that. He's known for blocking pins. Mbappe lined them up. Emiliano Martinez lined Mbappe up trying to read his mind. He suits it. Emiliano Martinez reads Mbappe's mind, dives the correct way and everything, but Mbappe got that damn aura. The aura from Mbappe's foot translated to the aura on that goddamn ball. It hit Emiliano's hand. If there was anybody else, he would have threw that shit the hell up out of there. But because it was Mbappe's ball, that hoe has aura around it. That hoe ooh, went past his hand. I say, ooh, he gets right. France is in the game now. Momentum is a wild thing as far as because it's not something tangible that you can touch. You can't scientifically prove momentum, but that hoe is a goddamn fool. Less than a minute later, France has the ball in that final third. Mbappe headers that whole teammate popped it up back to him. Mbappe leaned his body to the side. He swung his body to the side real diagonal like, and he ah, hit that hoe to the back of the net. I say, he scored it. He scored it. Ain't no way he just goddamn scored that goal to equalize the game in the goddamn World Cup final when them boys had zero shots on target. Zero shots, period. Ain't no way he just did that. Not in the World Cup final. Oh, Bobby, you like that? That man got him a brace in like one minute of game time. I say, oh, Leo Dale. Y'all finna go out like this. Before he even scored that, I was like, bro, y'all know when Mbappe, Mbappe do this, he scored the what? The little added time goal against uh, uh, Real Madrid in the Champions League final last year? I said, y'all know Mbappe do that, right? Next thing I know, hitter, pop up pass, lean to the side. I got bottom right corner. So I said, will somebody score again? Bro, all types of chances and chances and chances, but it ends up going to extra time. Lataro Martinez gets subs in the game, and he fumbles the bag probably like three different times. I'm like, oh my gosh, that man Gonzalo Higuain, for real, for real. I'm talking about he had chances. 
France had chances too. Oh my God, those chances they had at the end of the game. I say, ooh, I can't take this. I can't take this, bro. No, my, oh my mama, I can't take this. This is a little too heated. A little too heated for me. The 108th minute. Second half of extra time. Argentina goes on a run. Boom. Latar Martinez tried to shoot. It gets blocked. Lionel right there, janitor, clean up crew. Ooh, Lionel, Messi hits that hoe in. I say, Messi! Messi, 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 go, 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 I say, you can't write a better script than that. Lionel did hit that pin, but I wanted him to get him an open play goal, too, just to make it sweeter. I say, Lionel need him an open play goal, or the haters go call him pissy. So go ahead and get your open play goal. He got that open play goal. I say, oh, it's going to goddamn Argentina, man. They finally done did it. France has the ball on their final third before the end of the goddamn game. Two minutes left. 118th minute. Boo boo! Handball on goddamn Argentina. I say, oh. Oh, not like this. Not like this. Oh my goodness, please. Not like, not like this. Ain't no way it gonna be like this. Oh, Kylian Mbappe. I say, oh. Is he gonna get a hat trick? The first hat trick since 1966 is the bloke. I forgot bloke name, but they said it on TV. First hat trick since 1966? Will it be? Will it happen? Emiliano Martinez on that opposite end. Kylian Mbappe sitting there composed. Cool. He. <gasps> He's him. He went to the side. He. I say, yeah. Yeah, Kylian. You're him. You're him, Kylian. If I was in the crowd, order. You're him. <gasps> he. Mm, like that. I like that celebration. That's one of my favorite celebrations. He say, mm. I say, yeah. He's him, boy, Killing them Bobby. He's next up, for real, for real. Speed, the whistle blows, is going to penalties. The goddamn World Cup final. Argentina, France. Everybody roll France off after Argentina got that 2-0 lead. 2-0 lead is the most dangerous in football, but come 79th minute, well, everybody like, bro, France is done, bro. They're finished, man. No doubt in my mind that Argentina wasn't going to win. You know why? They got a guy over there. He goes by the name of Emiliano Martinez. First person walk up to take that pin. Ooh, Kylian Mbappe. I say, ooh, will he be able to hit three pins on Emiliano? That's hard. Who, 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 who? Emiliano Martinez reads his mind again, dives the correct way again. But that goddamn aura on that ball, from the aura of Kylian Mbappe's foot, he's one of the chosen ones. He's he's gonna be up there. Mbappe is gonna be one of those. He gonna be one of those dudes. Aura, aura. Palm, Emiliano Martinez got a palm full of that goddamn ball. Bloop, bloop, went straight to the back of the net. I say, oh, Killian. Second person of old oh, Lionel Messi. I say, oh, Lionel, please don't miss it. Please, because they're going to be crucifying you on Twitter. Lionel, who oh, straight down the middle. He, I'm Lionel. I say, oh, next person up. Goddamn, come on. I say, oh, yeah. Emiliano finna eat this boy alive. I said before the penalty kick started, I was like, Emiliano is blocking at least two. France ain't had a penalty kick shootout in the World Cup since 2006. Come on, sitting up there. <sighs> Emiliano sitting right there. <gasps> Emiliano say, ah, he blocked that hole. He, yeah, I say, yeah, this is raps. As soon as he blocked that, I was like, yeah, this is game over. I forgot who was the next person on Argentina who shot it. They made it on Hugo Lloris. That was bullying Hugo Lloris. Oh, my mama, he was in there getting bullied. Argentina made it. Second pin to a mean real Madrid boy. Hala Madrid. I say, you got to avenge Hala Madrid because goddamn Rodrigo, he missed his penalty against Croatia. You got to avenge him. He looked nervous, too. He was sitting on here. Emiliano Martinez was sitting there talking his talk. He go smirk at him. He smirked at him. I was like, okay, he since he smirked, he probably go hit this hole. And Emilio Martinez sitting there transmitting his ways to his mind to a mini. <sighs> Kick that hole. Straight missed the goddamn goal. I say, oh yeah. There's raps. There's raps right there. Oh, Africa FC is finna go home. The airport is this away. Third player, I forgot who from Argentina shot it, but they ended up making theirs too. They made it too. Now, Emiliano Martinez with a French dude to win the game, to save, to save the goddamn game. Get Lionel that trophy. Bring that trophy home to Argentina. French dude hits you. They like, woo. Now, bro, step up for Argentina. To say the day to send it home. Gonzalo Montiel takes up. <gasps> Good! Argentina wins the goddamn FIFA 2022. No, 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 no. 
World Cup and Sin. You can't write a better script than this. And Sin's the goddamn trophy to Lionel Messi to complete his legacy. It's like a goddamn movie. Disney World, Disney Channel movie. You can't write a better feel-good story than this, bro. I wonder how Cristiano and Neymar are them feeling at home watching this happen. Well, Neymar is Lionel's teammate. I'm sure he's happy. I wonder how Cristiano is feeling, you know, over her sitting at home. Argentina, they have did it for the first time in 36 years since old um, Diego Maradona did it. Lionel did it. Greatest World Cup game I've seen. Y'all say it's the greatest final. This is the only final I've seen, so y'all say it's the greatest final. I'm pretty sure it's the greatest final. Woo! Greatest, like I said, greatest sports game I have ever seen. Bro. Now we gotta go back to watching Bournemouth and Everton, man. Man, this World Cup journey, even for the channel, we brought a lot of engagement to the channel. I hope y'all stick through. Appreciate everybody for coming through. Check me out. I hope I made a lot of y'all laugh. Provided a lot of entertainment for y'all boys. I'm out, bro. What can I say? Shout out Lionel and Argentinas, man. I forgot to do it, but before the video end, come on, bro. We gotta do the theme song one time for the one time, man. Don't know, no.